In the past we had a library which had no reader spaces on the ground floor. We had a lot of problems reconciling the needs of people who want really quiet study space and students who more and more want to study together and talk as they study. And what we wanted to do was to produce a space where people had different ways of learning, different ways of studying, but at the same time would allow people who wanted to work quietly to do so elsewhere. So the people who want to work quietly can still go upstairs to the upper floors. The Central Library is at the heart of the South Kensington campus, and what we've been able to achieve is creating an extra 400 study spaces by refurbishing the, the, the ground floor of the library. For the first time this year, we're going to be open 24 hours throughout the academic year, so from October through to June, the, the library will be open for students to use as and when they want. The group study area on level one, we refer to as the mobile zone because it's got movable furniture and screens that can be repositioned to define the space. I love the mobile zone, I love the colour in it, I love the quirkiness of it, I love the fact that you don't quite know where you're going to go, you go around a corner and gosh there's something else there and I think the students will love that as well. We've got the, the fantastic orange sea screens where people can meet in sort of semi-discreet areas for, for group meetings, discussions, whatever. We've got the library lounge which is a calmer area in the far corner of the floor. And we've got the think tanks, which are my favourite area of the library. This is particularly special and I think unique. I think this is considered very exciting. I think we're going to attract a lot of attention in the sector with this. All over college already, people are coming to this library and saying how wonderful it is. It will become the new centre for the campus. It will be the new hub for students and staff alike. As a student um, that lives and works in London, it can be very difficult to uh, find a space which is uh, suitable for working uh, and quite, quite relaxing at the same time. What I really like about the library is the number of computers. Most of the students uh, are in Bria. The library is like our second home. It's very light and bright. The seating is very comfortable. You don't get um, too many back problems from working away and uh, there's a lot of room. It feels very fresh with the colour scheme. One of the key service points is our help desk. Library staff are based there and can offer help and advice using both our print and electronic collections, offer advice on library services both in the building and generally across the campus. The Library Cafe is one of our new study areas. It's open long hours, it gives students and staff the chance to grab a coffee whilst in the library. But it's also a great place to use our IT facilities. It's wireless enabled throughout and has both individual PCs and larger screen PCs where people can work together in groups. I find this is far better than sort of a regular coffee shop. Um, you have less people coming and going, and uh, it's a very good place to, to think and get, get work done. I find it also a very quiet area to study. I'm sitting in the Wolfson IT Learning Suite, which is an open access area with 50 new student PCs at the front of the space. And at the back of the floor, we have two bookable group study rooms and a teaching space for the library liaison teams. The first day this library opened, People came in and it was as if they'd always been here. They sat down and took it for granted. And I think that speaks volumes for the very good design. This is the first of five floors that make up the central library. On the upper levels, you'll find that our books and journals collections that are divided by faculty. On level two, we'll find engineering and physical science books. Up on level three is the Science Museum Library. On level four, there's life sciences and medicine. And on level five is the business, humanities and computing collections. The recent refurbishment of the central library level one has transformed how we can offer services to students. It's a fantastic space in the centre of campus where students can come, meet, study and learn. We have very impressive, very ambitious students at Imperial College and in my view they deserve the best. And this new library level one to me is the best for very good students and I think they will appreciate it and they will treat it with great respect which is lovely. We're very proud of it.